Donna Scheller here. I'm so glad that you could join me today, whether you're joining me on the replay or you're with me live. This is AnnaScheller.com and this, this is, I was supposed to actually do this about mm, three hours ago. But you know what I was doing? I had blocked off time to make phone calls and concentrate on connecting with new people for my business. Can I tell you a little secret? I was a little apprehensive when I got started, but I realized that if I didn't get started in two or three months, I would be searching for people who would need our product, our, our, our housing business. And so I decided that if I wanted to have business in two to three months, I had to start contacting people now. And I happened to stumble across an article that gave a list of people who might have a need for what we do. So why am I sharing all this? Well, first of all, to apologize for not being here when I promised to be here. But second, to encourage you in a couple of things. One of the reasons I'm doing this is because really doing the tasks that we're uncomfortable with is really a time or a self-management issue. What do I mean by that? You know when you were a kid, if you didn't have to do something, you didn't do it. And often you putzied around, maybe your mom told you to clean your room, and you're like, yeah, 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 I'll get to it. And, and you just kept finding other things to do, things that you enjoyed, until you finally got in trouble for not cleaning your room. And then, of course, that meant that you had to sacrifice something you really wanted to do because now you were in trouble and you had to clean your room. Well, we get in that way with as adults because we don't have mom or dad standing behind us to make us do the work. But our success is dependent on the actions that we take today. What we do today creates our success for tomorrow. And so the thing about prospecting is that you have to make the time to do it. You have to put it on your calendar and you have to get to it. There's just really no other way around it. This month in my membership website we were talking about the importance of time management and there were some productivity hacks. If you are interested I'd love to encourage you to go to my website go to annasheller.com forward slash membership and you know take a look at it see if there's something there that would be of interest to you running a special right now about you know the first 27 people that get in can get in for just twenty seven dollars a month and after that it's going to go up uh, but it's just an easy way to get regular content from me and also to interact with me here but this is different this this ties into time management but it also ties into what I'm going to be talking about in my next module which goes live on Monday and that is making phone calls you see we need to block the time to make to, in order to do the things that we don't want to do maybe you need to reward yourself at the end but what I try to do is I try to block at least an hour to an hour and a half on my prospecting days, which I have at least three of those a week, in order to contact new clients. Prospecting is about looking for new people. You also have to take care of those other people, but you block that time out. It is an appointment you make for yourself, and you let other people know not to call you, and so, or not to, to, to interrupt you. Is it going to be tough? Well, you got to start with a list so that you have people to call and so you have to do some homework but don't wait till everything's perfect to get started a lot of times I'll be talking to someone and I'll find out from someone that person that there are other people who could use my product or service but they may not be the person who is interested in what I have so Every call I look at as an opportunity either to familiarize somebody with my business or to actually set an appointment to get them, get in front of them to share with them how I can help them. Always a primary objective and a secondary objective. But sometimes I have to go through a lot of phone numbers in order to find a live person to talk to. 
And that's sometimes what scares people. Oh, I have to leave another voicemail. Oh, nobody wants to talk to me. You can't talk that way. Block out the time. Have faith that the work you're doing is going to be planting seeds today for work that's going to come to you later, a month, two months, three months later. Because wouldn't you like to have the work that you're doing now bring you money when you're generally going to be slow? Well, anyway, this is Anna Scheller talking to you about time productivity. And you can find me at AnnaScheller.com or like my page. You're here at my page. Go ahead, like it, because then you'll get notifications when I'm live again. Thank you so much for joining me, and have a great day.